Hey man, that's all I gotta say. Nothing. No, I'm kidding. But hey, you know what I'm saying? You know how to get it right. You feel me? Like, I know the braids not looking, you know what I'm saying? Looking crispy and clean, because you know what I'm saying? I had to do it myself, you know what I'm saying? It took me like five hours, but you know what I'm saying? We still did it. It's about time for real. Nah, I'm cap. I'm cap. Uh, I didn't do the braids. My homegirl did, but um, I just have like short hairs that I'm trying to grow out, so I can it can match my actual hair. And I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I thought the braid was gonna look clean when it got a little when the shorter hairs got a little longer, but I don't know. It's kind of looks like a mess still, but I'm I'm rocking it. You know what I'm saying? Hey, let me know what y'all think about the braids. And you think you think I should keep doing the braids for real? Like. You know what I'm saying? I rarely get braids, cause you know what I'm saying? I just love the curls, bro. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I love my curls, so. so yeah, peep, um, you know what I'm saying? I went to, I went to go drop off the orders here. Well, it's not really orders, but these are like the shorts that I need to take to my manufacturer. Today, I really wanted to like, take a step back, as y'all see in the pre previous vlog. Like, I've been on the go, and when you're on the go, like, Sometimes you, you can't really take care of yourself, you feel me? Like, so today, I'm a, it's a Saturday today, and uh, I'm going to take this day to, like, just do what I want to do. Like, a little reset and self-care day, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's why I got the braids done, you know what I'm saying? See the haircut? Uh, to a lot of y'all that be asking what I get for a haircut, I literally just get, like, a, I'm pretty sure it's, like, a mid-taper or, like, a low-taper. Like, oh, no, not taper, a uh, fade. It's a fade. And then I just have my hair like around, you know what I'm saying? Not not crazy, you know what I'm saying? Like just a little just a little lineup, you know what I'm saying? Not crazy. But yeah, um I know a lot of y'all are like also on the go too, but make sure to take care of yourself too, because you know what I'm saying? Like your body is your temple and like it's it's an investment, you know what I'm saying? If you don't take care of your body, then you wanna be able to do what you need to do, like Let's say for athletes like me as a student athlete, like I still take care of my body. Like I make sure I get my rest. Um, you know what I'm saying? So that's very important because if I don't get my rest, then my body's gonna break down. Like your body's like a machine. Like it, it's eventually gonna break down. Uh, so today I'm gonna just you know what I'm saying right now do a little self care. Uh, I'm gonna go get my nails done, and later on today I also have a a dentist appointment and. Today I also wanted to hit the flea market, so, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be dope, but, um, uh, keep watching the vlog, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be a good day, a little reset day. Hey, men, men can take care of themselves too, you know what I'm saying? Like, hey, if y'all think, you know what I'm saying, taking care of yourself is too, you know what I'm saying, feminine, too girly, like, you're wrong, bro. Like, everybody needs to take care of themselves, you feel me? So, if you see this video, and then, you know what I'm saying, you kind of in the same like on the go hustle and grind mentality sometimes it's good to take a day off bro like take the day to yourself and you know what i'm saying just chill you feel me yeah man i'ma see ya i'ma catch ya oh yo what's good um i'm back in the whip I just got done at the dentist. Uh, everything was good in there, you know what I'm saying? My teeth look good, you feel me? Nothing, no cavities, no nothing. You know what I'm saying? I'm really trying to stay on top of that, bro, because, like, I know when I, as I get older, bro, like, my teeth going to fall apart if I don't take care of it now. So, uh, hey, y'all make, make sure y'all take care of yourself, man. Like I said, your body's an investment, you know what I'm saying? Like, take care of yourself. But yeah, I also got my nails done. I couldn't really talk after uh, getting my nails done. I mean, not nails done, but like, you know what I'm saying? Nails clean, got my mani. I usually get mani petty, but today we're kind of short with time. The fleet closes in like two hours, so I want to make sure I have time for that. So right now, I'm gonna go head out to the flea market and I'm gonna catch y'all there. It's gonna be a vibe, bro. Like every time I go there, I'll be finding something new something good and today i'm hoping to find like some jorts some vintage tees maybe some leather jacket i know it's kind of hot right now but you know what i'm saying 
gotta do what you gotta do for the, you know what I'm saying, the flicks, you feel me, the content. But yeah, man, stay tuned and I'll keep y'all posted. Hey, you doing this day right now? Hey, so what you what you about to make me today? What you got for me? Brown sugar shake and espresso. Uh, brown brown sugar? Nah. Brown sugar. Ripping it, boy. Bro, I got a little I got a little story time for y'all, bro. So uh, so y'all know. I went to go see the homie Josh. Uh, he works at the spot called Andante. And um, bro, I had to rush out because bro, I thought the traffic enforcer was gonna, you know what I'm saying, give me a ticket. But I ain't gonna lie, I'm not sure if I got a ticket or not. But you know what I'm saying, he did got my plates, but I don't know, I'm, I, hope, I hope I didn't get no ticket because you know what I'm saying, I, I, that's the last thing I need today. Uh, or right now, bro. I'm, I ain't gonna lie, bro, I'm a little broke, but, you know what I'm saying, I've been getting ready for this pop-up, and I, I've been spending a lot of money on this event, specifically, so, it's not that I'm, you know what I'm saying, I'm spending money on shoes and clothes, but, it's, all that money is going to the pop-up, all that money is going to the pop-up, bro, and, like, that's the last thing I need right now, last thing I need is to pay, pay for a ticket, you know what I'm saying, so, Hopefully I don't get no ticket today. Um, but yeah, we just got to the we just got to the flea market. I ain't gonna lie, it's a little bit of far. I mean, it's a little bit of walk. Um, you know what I'm saying? But you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, I hope we find some good stuff today, and uh, I'm gonna just run some B-roll for y'all because I I wouldn't be able to vlog and like, you know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna get y'all right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show y'all the vibes I'm talking about. But peace. Good y'all, so I'm back, I'm back in the whip now. And bro, I ain't gonna lie. Hold on, let me put let me put this into it. I ain't gonna lie. Bro, I low-key spent some good amount of money in there, bro. Like, bro, they got so many good pieces, bro. Like, I got some I got some more rings because y'all know me with my accessories, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so I know some of y'all probably wonder where I get my rings from. I usually go to the flea market, but I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. They're kind of pricey over there. They were like $30 each. Like, bro, I know at one point I loved thrifting, bro, but then now that going back there, I kind of realized why like, I stopped going back, you know what I'm saying? Because like some of them just be taxing for real. And I kid you not, bro, I haven't thrifted in like couple months bro because I've just been so busy and like I feel like for me it's more convenient to just order it's more convenient for me to order online you know what I'm saying and lately I've just been wearing my brand really hey I'm not gonna lie to you I picked them so I picked up a couple pieces that it totally changing my style I've been wanting to like you know what I'm saying do different styles but I don't know if my you know what I'm saying y'all like the fits that I'll be putting on but hey if you like, if you like what you like, you know what I'm saying, wear it, you know what I'm saying. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see if we could like, you know what I'm saying, rock a different style. You feel me? But I'm not gonna lie, bro. I spent a little cool, like, like, like two hundred, bro. I'm not gonna lie, but, but I got some dope pieces, bro. I got this bomb leather jacket, and like brown, bro. I'm like, yo, I need to get this in my closet for real. Yeah, um, going back there, bro, kind of brought me some, you know what I'm saying, good memories because a lot of y'all know don't know this, but a lot of y'all do. Um, when I started my brand, I wasn't really, I wasn't really um, making a clothing brand. Like, I wasn't making all my pieces. I started off by thrifting. Um, I've always aspired to have a, you know what I'm saying, my own uh, tent because like those people inspire me as well. Like, I was like, one of these days, I'm going to be one of them. I'm going to have my own tent. Uh, we took another route. I decided to, like, just, you know what I'm saying, make my own pieces because I've always been creative, but, like, I just couldn't figure out what to do yet. But 
I found myself like started doing vintage pieces, like shirts and stuff like that. I started off that and I started liking it, you know what I'm saying? So I stuck with it and then the brand kind of kept growing and growing and I just stuck with the grind, bro. But but yeah, going back there, bro, like if y'all know the day ones that have been watching me since 2020, 2021, like y'all know I go every weekend like to thrift. Like that was my content before it was just thrifting, but other than that, man, today was a good day, bro. I ain't gonna cap to you. Um, right now, I might go hit Melrose. I'm trying to go get some Sambas, bro. I've been wanting that for a minute. So I think I'm gonna go grab that today to see if they have it, you know what I'm saying? But if not, oh well, I mean, I tried. But but yeah, uh, the day's not over yet. We still gonna go, you know what I'm saying, shop a little bit. Um, but I'm not gonna go too, too crazy, you know what I'm saying? But we'll see what we find for real. I'm gonna tap in. What's good, y'all? So, right now, I'm just I'm just trying to enjoy my acai. I got some uba tuba, you know what I'm saying? And, yo, that lady that was doing my, um, my acai, bro, she was so nice, bro. She was just like, she saw my camera and she was like, oh, you a vlogger? And she has this, like, she had this, like, little accent. Um, and she, I was like, uh, kind of, I'm trying, you know what I'm saying? And she's like, oh, it's okay, you can do it. Um, and I was like, that's crazy because this past few days, bro, I've been thinking like, man, I don't even want to pick up the camera right now because it's just like, I've been so busy. Like my, my semester, this semester about to be over. So I've just been so busy, but I was like, today I woke up and I was like, bro, let me, let me vlog real quick. And then, you know what I'm saying? Take y'all through my reset day. You know what I mean? Taking a step back today. Chilling, having fun, doing what I love to do, you know what I'm saying? Because, man, lately I've just been so caught up with work, school, basketball practice, like basketball workouts, you know what I'm saying? But here we are now, you know what I'm saying? Just just chilling with me, watching the vlog, you feel me? But uh, yeah, I got this acai ball, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I am so addicted to this. Delicioso. But yeah, it's pretty fire. Uh, right now I'm just sitting in a car and I found a spot right here. I'm gonna go take some flicks over there and you know what I'm saying I'm probably just gonna have y'all watch me just a little behind the scenes or I'll take my my reels or TikTok, you know what I'm saying? Pretty solid day. Too bad. I found the sambas, but they didn't have my size. I tried to go to Shoe Palace, they had this Adidas store. And they didn't have the sambas. I think it's not for me for real. But I don't know, I could be wrong. But man, I've been looking for sambas for in a minute now. At least we found some other other things that I like. And you know what I'm saying? We're gonna, we gonna see how that goes, so. I'm about to go, I'm gonna go flick up. Not flick up, but like just make a video. Like a little fit check video. 